All right, so I'm about to do problem three. Again, I've got my blank skeleton code um, that I downloaded from the website. All right, it says, in this problem, you will draw a trail of circles wherever the mouse is dragged, whose color is dependent on the mouse's coordinates. You can, um, all right. So let's find setup and set my size to 255 again. Okay, oops. And top, okay. And then it's going to be a black canvas, so it's back down to zero. All right. In the mouse drag function, add a line to change the color of the fill based on the x coordinate of the mouse for the amount of red and the y coordinate of the mouse for the amount of blue. Okay. Let me find mouse dragged. So I am changing fill. And the way that I can use the x coordinate of the mouse to col control the amount of red is that here in the r or red position of the fill function, I'll just put my mouse x variable. And so this is actually the reason that for this problem I've asked you to make your size be 255 by 255, because if you'll remember, the values for um, the colors can range from 0 to 255. As long as I make my canvas that size, then my mouse values um, will accurately describe color values that can be used by the fill function. Okay, So that is for the red. It says, um, let the Y coordinate of the mouse be for blue and no green. So it's RGB or red, green, blue. So I'm going to put a zero for green and then let mouse Y control my blue. Okay. And then it says, add a statement to draw a circle of radius 10 at the current position of the mouse. So that's just going to be ellipse. Mouse X, mouse Y, and again, it's radius 10, so it's going to be a height and width of 20. Okay, let's try this out. Okay, so if I click nothing, but if I drag, you can see that the fill is changing depending on where I am on the screen. Um, so you'll notice there's no green, but it's going to fade between red and, uh, and blue. When I'm up here in the upper left-hand corner, um, I'm too close to black for it to be really visible, so it's hard to see. Um, but this will keep changing the color and drawing new circles so long as I keep dragging my mouse around. So that's pretty cool.